third standard second term science unit 1 food evaluation questions first choose the correct answer first question bread wheat and potatoes are rich in dash bread wheat and potato are rich in carbohydrate the answer is option b carbohydrate bread wheat and potato are rich in carbohydrate the second question a balanced diet contains dash option a carbohydrate and vitamins option b proteins fat and minerals option c fiber and water option d all the above the correct answer option d all the above so a balanced diet contains carbohydrate vitamins proteins fat minerals fiber and water option d all the above third question the vitamin present in carrot is dash the vitamin presence in carrot is option b is correct answer vitamin a the vitamin presence in carrot is option b answer vitamin a next question which of these things are bad for you which of these things are bad for you eating green vegetables washing vegetables before cutting them eating lot of fat food items eating lot of pulses eating green vegetable is good washing vegetables before cutting them also is good eating lot of pulses also good but option c is eating lot of fat and food items is wrong is bad bad items so fourth one which of these things or bad for you the answer is option c eating lot of fat food items last question fifth question the given picture shows that raman is most likely eating his a breakfast b lunch c dinner students look the picture what time in the picture 1 45 so noon time so raman eat his lunch Raman is most likely eating his lunch option B lunch is the correct answer fill in the blanks first question food rich in dash are called bodybuilding food bodybuilding food enna solvanga eda solvanga proteins so answer is proteins food rich in proteins are called bodybuilding food second question that helps in proper functioning of our body answer is minerals minerals helps in proper functioning of our body the third question a dash is necessary for the proper growth and development of our body the answer is balanced diet a balanced diet is necessary for the proper growth and development of our body the fourth question sprouted seeds contains more dash answer is proteins sprouted seeds contains more proteins fifth question dash is the second meal of a day lunch is the second meal of a day next match the following first one carbohydrate and fats second vitamins third protein and final fourth minerals answer the matching the following carbohydrate and fats energy giving food carbohydrate and fats energy giving food second vitamins fight diseases vitamins fight diseases third protein supports body growth proteins support body growth protein supports body growth minerals regulated body functions minerals regulated body functions okay answer the following questions first question 
How many nutrients are there? What are they? How many nutrients are there? What are they? The answer is there are five main nutrients. They are carbohydrates, proteins, fats, vitamins and minerals. They are carbohydrates, proteins, fats, vitamins and minerals. Second question is Siva is 6 years old. He needs to have good amount of proteins. Give reason. Siva is 6 years old. He needs to have good amount of proteins. Give reason. The answer is Proteins are known as bodybuilding foods. They build, maintain and replace the tissues in our body. So, Siva needs to have good amount of proteins. Third one, what is a balanced diet? What is a balanced diet? A balanced diet contains all nutrients in the right amounts. It also includes fiber and water. It helps in the growth and development of our body. Fourth question, what are the meals in a day? What are the meals in a day? Breakfast, lunch and dinner are the meals in a day. Breakfast, lunch and dinner are the meals in a day. Fifth question, what are some traditional food items? Some traditional food items. Rahi, Tinai, Samai, Kudirewali, Varagu and Kambu are some traditional food items. Rahi, Tinai, Samai, Kudirewali, Varagu and Kambu or some traditional food items. Six and last question. Write any three advantage of a home garden. Answer is advantages of home garden. It is the easiest method. It is the easiest method. Waste water can be reused. Waste water can be reused. It saves our money. It saves our money. And finally, we get vegetables which are fresh and high in nutritive value. We get vegetables which are fresh and high in nutritive value. Students, நீங்க உங்க வீட்ல சிறிய தோட்டம் அமைச்சு பராமரிங்க. அதுல நிறைய fruits and vegetables உங்களுக்கு கடைக்கும். வீட்ல இருந்து வெளியேற வேஸ்ட் வாட்டர் அத குளிக்கிற தண்ணி கை கால் கழுவுற தண்ணி இத போல வேஸ்ட் வாட்டர் அந்த செடிகளுக்கு அந்த தோட்டத்துக்கு நீங்க கொடுத்தீங்க கொடுத்து ரீயூஸ் பண்ணலாம் அப்புறம் நம்மளுடைய பணத்தையும் சேமிக்கலாம் fruits vegetables வீட்லயே கிடைக்கிறதுனால பணம் மிச்சமாகும் நமக்கு ஃப்ரெஷாவும் நல்ல சத்து மிக்கதாகவும் கிடைக்கும் இந்த வீடியோ உங்களுக்கு பிடிச்சிருந்தா லைக் பண்ணுங்க ஷேர் பண்ணுங்க Subscribe பண்ணுங்க